So Lizzie and I are gonna clean her room and do a quick little interview. Hey. And so we have 15 minutes before Lizzie's mommy comes home to clean the room. Okay, Lizzie. What? Are these clean or dirty? Did anybody tell anybody that they liked them at school today? Well, there is gossip in my class. <gasps> Gossip. What happened? Tell me the juicy gossip. Someone wrote to my ex crush that they liked him. And so there are two people who were like looking around. Did they and put looking the... at people's handwriting? Too. Oh, so it was just a note, but they didn't put their name on it. Yeah. Ooh. They were looking at people's handwriting, uh -huh. see if it looked like the note. And so I wrote my name, and it looked a lot like the note. So they thought but it was I you? I didn't write it. Did they find out who wrote the letter? No, they never told me. What did the letter say, do you know? I like you, Mason. That's it? Yeah. So they never found out who it was? I don't think so. Did they ask you if it was you? To say, hey, did you write this? And you said... They're asking everyone in the class. Who's they? Mason, the boy? Mason, the boy. And his friends? Well, like, a girl in my class is Mason. Oh, do you think maybe she's got a crush on him? Maybe. Ooh. That's what I think. If you like someone, you take the least suspicious act. Yes. Like if you come... Like if you murder someone. If you murder someone, what's... Yeah, and you are Sherlock Holmes. It's very unsuspicious. So, if you're Sherlock Holmes and you murder someone, people won't expect... Yes! So, exactly. what if she's think? like, oh, let's find out who wrote this letter, they won't suspect her. She's like the <laughs> Sherlock Holmes of love. You're in fourth grade. When I was in fourth grade, I had my first crush. Is this girl named Leslie. Ew, Leslie. And I... Listen to this. One day we were on the bus, and Together? and this boy, no, 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 we took different buses, but this boy I lived next door to, Daniel, he got the whole bus chanting, Chris and Leslie sitting in a tree, K-I-S-S-I-N-G. And I said, well, Daniel is married to Mrs. Piggle Wiggle. Because that was a book back then. And he got so mad, he went home, told his mom that I was mean to him. I wasn't allowed to go to the carnival, the school carnival that night. But he got to go. But he was the one that got the whole bus chanting. To this day, it's still my smell. But then I used to call Leslie, because we were like boyfriend and girlfriend. And we used to, I'd call her, and all I'd say is hi. Uh, are we still boyfriend girlfriend? She's like, yeah, I'm like, okay, bye. Say goodbye. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any juicy gossip.